So here we're being asked to find the two missing interior angles, this one over here uh, and this one down the bottom here. Um, so working through these we're going to need to know uh, a couple of things first of all about our relationship between interior and exterior angles uh, and also about the uh, total sum of the interior angles of this shape. So starting over here where we've got that 70 degrees as our exterior angle, uh, we know that an exterior angle and its corresponding interior angle add up to 180 degrees. And from that fact, if we subtract 70 degrees from 180, uh, we get 110 degrees as the size of that interior angle. Now that we've got that angle there, we've got four of our five interior angles, which means we'll be able to work out the remaining fifth uh, interior angle. But first of all, we need to know the total interior angle sum of this shape. It is a five-sided shape, a pentagon, um, and so either we can just know that the total interior angle is 540 degrees, or if we didn't have that information to hand, we can get it by using the formula, remembering that the total interior angle of an n-sided polygon is 180 multiplied by n minus 2. So again, n is the number of sides here, so that's 5 minus 2 is 3, and 180 times 3 is going to give us that 540 degrees that we've got there. So a total of those five angles is 540, so we just need the total of the four angles that we know, which is going to be 110 plus 90, from that right angle there, plus 100 plus 120, uh, which gives us 110 plus 90 is 200, plus 100 gives us 300, plus the 120 gets us up to 420 degrees in total. That means the remaining angle is 540 minus 420, uh, which will give us 120 degrees as our answer there.